Hi everyone, it's Jules and I'm going to be doing a glue book session today and I'm really bummed because I just went to go look to order more of these books that I love. It's the Arteza watercolor book and uh, they're sold out everywhere. Amazon on the Arteza website because I'm thinking I want to do a giveaway soon and I was thinking, ooh, what if I did one of these books and then send like an inspiration packet like something like this where I send the images so you can create something and I'm just bummed so I got on the waiting list or whatever the email list to say have them send me an email when they come back in stock but I hope they're not discontinued I don't know what I'm gonna do <laughs> I don't have any more <laughs> oh such problems I have okay so let's start with a quote out of our book don't forget to sing in the lifeboats Life is tough, but it's tougher when you're stupid. <laughs> John Wayne. I think I need to rip that one out and put it in my junk journal. Awesome. All right. So today's inspiration packet is kind of uh, red, black, red and black, which is my favorite combo. Or more just red, I guess I should say. So kind of fitting for Valentine's Day coming up soon with the hearts. You know what I just saw, I don't, I just pulled an image out of a magazine. I'm like, oh, she needs to go. Yeah, it's probably way too many big images, but we'll see what happens. So let's find a blank page. Let's kind of go to the back here. I have too much stuff on my desk right now. All right. I suppose I should have been prepared and my cutter out and everything. Oh no, just start recording. All right. I don't even have my magazine out. Oh my gosh, to to glue on, you know? <laughs> okay, I'm ready. So, uh, we're supposed to get up to like 40 some degrees here in Minnesota today. Pretty excited about that. Not sure if I'll go outside, but I did set out some pork chops to make for supper. That was not straight at all. Oh, jeez. I think I want to cut that out. She does have a little, little face there, so I guess I'll just kind of cut her on that a little bit. Like that, maybe? Yeah, so I laid out some pork chops so we can grill them because it's going to be so nice. Yeah, you know you live in Minnesota when you're like, oh, it's 40 degrees, it's so nice out. Maybe I want to cut her out too. All right, speed this part up. What can I start using for background? Okay, let's get these guys laid down. <clears throat> I can move that back over there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think I'm just going to cut out the bottle because that's 
be too much blue in there if I cut it like this. So I'm just going to cut out the bottle here. So yeah, I want to work on kind of a packet of inspiration packet for a giveaway. I'm thinking I'll do a giveaway when I hit a thousand subscribers, if I hit a thousand. So that would be great if I do that. So I'm thinking I want to do a book like this, if it's available at that time. Or I could find a different book, like maybe the Canson book, um, then an inspiration packet, and then maybe some glue sticks. That's what I'm thinking. Well, that turned out to be really little. <laughs> okay. So I spent a whole day, not a whole day, but afternoon working on making a new junk journal for spring. So I'll show that to you. Ugh, this paper is just, everything glues on it so nicely. Oh man, I'm really sad about this. Okay. Uh, this is my spring junk journal. So I just made it out of a file folder again like I did my last one and then I double this is just sitting in there oh no that's not these are sitting in there and I double put another sheet of file folder just to make it a little thicker right there so and then this paper was from a piece of paper I got at paper source and then I just put fabric and sewed around it sewed in two signatures and then cut up more of that paper to put inside here and put on some tabs I think it's cute Kind of, it reminds me of spring with the orange and yellow. So yeah, and these were actually, I cut it all up, it was one image like this. And I cut it up because, um, to fit in the junk journal. But this was a thing I got in Washington DC at one of the museums, National Archives maybe, so I thought, and I just had it sitting in the basement. So I'm like, well, it'll be perfect in this junk journal. Kind of has a adult beverage theme, I guess you'd say. So yeah, I did that. That was fun. thought about speeding this video up because I have a book I need to finish for book club it always book club just always sneaks up on me I'm not sure why so um, I actually ended up downloading the audiobook which I think I've done every time to make it go faster but the book it's called the sweetness of water it's great writing I think it's a debut novel but the subject matter is pretty rough it's at the end of the Civil War so yeah it's not something I normally gravitate towards I don't normally like period pieces type books or I don't like super sad like almost depressing type books so This is like a, she's driving an old car. So I think I'll do <clears throat> work on collating or whatever you want to call it. What do you call it when you gather images together? Um, curating. Images for my giveaway. I'll do that after I do this spread. Probably want to cut her out too so there's not so much blue in there. Who am I? Cutting all this stuff out.
So the Oscar nominations were this morning. Today is Tuesday, February 8th. Um, it seems like Power of the Dog is going to be kind of a front runner. I did watch it. I tried to watch it. I think I need to try again. Because... See, I don't really like her hair and stuff. I mean, I like her hair, but... I'm going to put that there. Anyway, so... Yeah, that seems to be a front runner. And... Dune, I guess. I have not watched Dune. I should have watched it when it was free on... Was it free on Disney or something for a while? Hulu? I don't know. HBO Max. Not sure what it was free on first. Now you can't stream it for free right now. Well, still pay for the service. You know what I'm saying. That needs to go right there. Well, that's just going to cover up that guy. I don't really want to cover up all that car. Do I forget about her? No. Do I forget about this image? Or do I just chop off... I'll just chop off some fingers. Oh, of course. I didn't measure, so... What am I going to put there? Where? Maybe I could put this girl there. I don't know. Hmm. What's going on? Am I going to need more images? That'd be weird. I thought I had plenty. Just placed an order for more um, Lazare archive magazines. It's been a while. It's been a while since I ordered any, so it was okay. <laughs> but you know, just what I need: more images. Okay. So I have these girls, which I feel like I need to cut them out as well. Who am I cutting all this stuff out? Not in squares or rectangles. You know what, what if I just took a piece of this and put it right there? Should I measure? It's like not... Very big at all. And it's like right there.
good enough. Our Alexa just went off. Oh, I like that. Okay. I'm decorating my black and white new glue book a little bit more, the front of it. Looks like that's her lips, maybe, coming out of there. So, so far, I don't know if you remember, I pulled this guy out, and I'm like, he has to go on the front. He's so stinking cute. Put on Misty Copeland. I put on some gesso that's obviously not dry yet. <laughs> Whoopsies. Okay, she's going there, right? Is that what I did? Yeah. watching um the it's something gypsy she does like art journals and art and what is it something gypsy anyway she's pretty popular and on youtube and she was saying how there's science or whatever that uh oh i kind of like covering up the one eye Although her eyes are just stunning. I need background stuff. Okay. Anyway, so she was saying that watching, you know, like doing this is relaxing and it's like therapy. But then also she was saying that watching somebody do this is relaxing um can cause that whatever in your brain to be have that relaxed uh it's not serotonin is it serotonin anyway so i thought that was interesting that there actually is science about watching people craft because i love it and i love the sound of the paper I love this image. I want to make that an inspiration piece. I should pull it out. Should I put Snoop Dogg in there? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I don't know if that'll work. It's kind of reddish. It could be a good background. Like I think for my inspiration packet for my giveaway, I want to include images like this where I've already used images very similar to this a couple times, so that somebody else could take advantage of using them. Or like in the Lazare magazine, they always have ads that's like, you know, let's see, let me find one. Well, this one. It's two that are very similar. So if I use one, I may not want to use it again, the other one, but anyway. Where is red stuff when you need red stuff? I see lots of blue. Oh my gosh, there's some red. See where we're at. I 
watched on Netflix, The Tender Swindler. Oh my gosh. Scary stuff. It actually gave me anxiety watching it. <laughs> about a guy who basically swindled women, found them on Twitter, and portrayed himself as somebody he wasn't, and swindled money out of them, and then kind of like a Ponzi scheme, but just scary. And it's, you know, international and many different countries. them there. Do I want to cover up her face? Her eye? I don't think I do. I'm not sure I'm going to use these girls right now. Because I really like the way that all looks. Well, I'll just save them. I'm just going to put that there. It's just background. Still need more background. Do I have anything in my random bucket? I see some red. I see some red. Well, it's kind of orangey. That's a little bit. You know what? And I wouldn't be mad about adding a little black in the background. Okay. Yay. Let's actually put that. Let's divide that in two. Let's see, did I measure correctly? <laughs> Good enough. I guess the quote on this page has to have the word love in it, I guess. Or kisses, hugs, heart. that there and I'm just I guess I didn't really need that other piece of black lace or almost looks like I think that's some tights well I am gonna be super bummed if I can't find these books anymore. Have I mentioned that? If someone happens to find them, let me know.
cool. I like it. All right, now for a quote. Maybe something from my bucket. I went through my new mantra, mantra, wellness. Got a ton of images out of or there, all these quotes. Maybe something about loving yourself. I'm enough. I like that. Oh, and look, it has like purple and... I got a lot of good uh, quotes or whatever out of, the, I think it was the Gin Magazine, G-I-N. Uh, if you haven't noticed, I say my I's and E's kind of funky. I get made fun of by my family a lot. <laughs> good on you. Maybe this one and then something from Lou Holtz. Lou Holtz. <laughs> Tim Holtz. <laughs> oh my gosh. Have an open heart. Um, yep. I literally thought that was a piece of my hair. It's her hair. Okay, I think I want to put it over here, but... Looking for some washi tape. It's a pinkish red, but it'll do. And this stuff, I really don't need to glue it because it is pretty sticky, but people glue book with using um, like matte uh, what do you call it like Mod Podge what is it called oh my gosh I gotta look just 
just a gel matte medium. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I make such a mess and it just, it bubbles on me. I'm sure I'm just using too much, but those people are talented. <laughs> I absolutely love this. Love, love, love. All right. Thanks for watching, you guys. Have a great day.